All right, we're, we're good. Make up. <laughs> okay, here's what you're gonna get from me. You're gonna get the overall property inspection report. It's kind of like a photo album of the house. It'll show everywhere I went, what I looked at, basically what I was doing in the house. It'll show you the ages of things, capacities, about how much light will be left also too. Then there's the key findings report that condenses it down if there's any um, issues with the house, that's where it'll be, it'll be in the key findings report. Here's the other thing, that roof is newer, so they might want to consider getting, you know, when they go to their insurance company, to get a wind mitigation. Because it'll, it'll do well. It'll do well in there because the roof is in good condition. Uh, the nailing was done, redone over, which is good. It's the spacing of the nailing for the decking. Plus they have the single over straps. Okay? So they'll get a big discount off of their insurance. And what Dave does is he takes the pictures now. Yeah, I'll hold on. So if they decide to order it later, he can just write up the report. He doesn't have to come back out. Right. So if, you know, a week or so down and in their insurance guy goes, you need a wind mitigation, all they have to do is call the company up, order one, it's $95, I'll get it out that night. Okay? All right, let's go outside. We'll start by the pool first. Okay. The pool was running when I came here, but I put it through its paces to make sure everything was working correctly. Um, you can see, if you look down at the bottom of the pool, there's been some patching done to this, which is okay. And it was all taken care of. So you can see it over there, mm -hmm. and then over there too. Mm -hmm. and it looks like somebody, you know, at one time either re resurfaced this pool or repainted this pool. It's one or the other. But that's okay. I don't see any major cracking or anything like that. So everything is working like it should. And I'll just turn it on for you real quick because there's aerators right there, those three, those three things. Mm -hmm. It shoots water out. So at some point you have to remarcite it to, to make that those little marks go away? That, no, that's not going to happen for a long time. Okay. But they got years before that will happen. Years? Okay. It's chilly today, huh? You wouldn't know it. It's beautiful looking out. It's probably in the 60s and we're complaining, but maybe in the 50s. Yeah, no, 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 I'm not complaining. I'm just saying. <laughs> you Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it was like that when we came here, so we saw that running. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. One thing about the pool, they did have a solar heater for it before, mm -hmm. but they cut it off. Here, you can see it over here on this side. They removed the solar heater? Yeah, there's no solar heater. You know why they would do that? Yeah, because it was probably leaking up there on the roof. Okay. The old roof, you just, you just cut the pipe. Okay, so it no longer has solar then? No, so it's whatever the temperature is going to be, right. they heat it up during the summer and that's what it's going to do. And there's no heater on this thing? No. Okay, so you just have natural, you know, right. from the it's elements. Just, it's just whatever temperature it reaches, that's going to be. So right. Go to the part of the house now. Okay. Like I was saying, this roof, that's an architectural shingle roof. It's generally a 25 to 30 year roof, just depending on which one they bought. Some of them now go 40 and 50 years, but I have no way of knowing unless they bring some sort of proof of what it is. So they're gonna get a lot of life left in that roof. How much life, I mean, how much, how much age do you think is on this roof? So it probably has 20 to 25 years left. Yeah. Okay, there's a couple of plumbing vents up there. See those metal pipes? One on the back side, one right over here, you can't see it. Right. Squirrels got to them. Okay. Chewed them up. So they need to be taken care of because otherwise water can leak in through those spots. I didn't see any damage when I went inside the attic. Everything looks good up in the attic, but it will over time. So those boots do need to be repaired. It's the one right over there, and then the one on the back side. Okay. Uh, entire exterior envelope, everything is in good condition. The blocks, there's no cracking, no settlement, no nothing going on. Windows look good, no problems there too. Same with the exterior doors. And everything will be in the report with pictures, so none of this you have to necessarily write down or remember, but he's just pointing it out now. And like I said, the uh, sprinkler system did not respond. Okay, sprinkler system did not respond. Right. 
Okay. Let's go to the garage. Okay. Okay. Everything is good in the garage. This is the control for the sprinkler box. Okay. Yeah. Which doesn't like to open up. There you go. Okay. See, it's telling me, but I tried to make it work and it just didn't. Now it's coming out. I'm telling you, it didn't work. Okay. So now you can still run the settings I mean, while we're here? We're going we're gonna to see what happens. It did not come out when I was trying to get it. Sprinkler. There you go. Okay, that comes off the report. I wonder why it would respond, come on before. They uh, had it turned off and I turned it on. That's why you should save your drinking till after the job. The job is over. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'll put. I'll hide the bottle better next time. <laughs> All right. Cool. Sprinklers work. Let's okay. yeah. That was something came last night. They encouraged me to ask. About, about the these are the uh, because it's a bushes. Lot of, yeah. You know, yeah. Bushes. Oh, okay. It does have a time or something like that, right? Yeah, yeah it's, a, it's a rain tree timer. You can set your, we gotta make sure we don't get sprayed. But yeah, it's it's on a timer. Clearly they work. Like, it looks like you're. That's zone three. Zone three? Yeah. I'll wait for these people to go out for the next one. Yeah, because like they, they don't wanna be here. Mm -hmm. I think so. I don't know when. There. Then these have to be. Make sure we don't get sprayed. Yeah, they clearly work. Yeah. That's another zone. Yep. Everything's working there. properly. Oh, cool. Why did come on last time? Good thing I tried it. I don't know. But it's cool. It works. It sure does. Good. Now I can take it off the report. Okay. Back to the garage now. Here's your electrical panel. Everything's good in the electrical panel. It's 200 amp service. Okay. There's no problems. Nobody played around with it. Okay, so everything's good there. Garage, everything's good in the garage. The opener, garage door, no problems out here. This is typical cracking. The garage floor is poured separate than the foundation, so this thing kind of floats in here. Sometimes it gets cracked in the way between the cars. Right. Okay, plumbing on city. City waste here too, okay? We have copper plumbing throughout the house. Okay. That's a good thing. Okay. Copper or PVC is okay as long as it's not going to That's a very good thing. Yeah. Because what I saw here, Holly Dooley. Okay. But it's not in the house. Okay. Okay, because I went through the whole house. So it's okay if it's in the garage? That's nothing. I, That's I don't nothing. know where that came from, why it's being used. Um, hot water heater is, how old is this thing again? Six years old. 50 gallons, so it's got a lot of life left to it. Okay. okay? Um, while we're outside, uh, we're going to talk about the heat pump. Heat pumps the air conditioning system. It does AC or heat. works either as the air conditioning or the heating system for the house. Okay. Unfortunately, that's the original unit here. It's still working properly, but it is 22 years old. How much longer it's going to last, I, I can't tell you. They could last a few days or could last a few years. There's no way to know anymore. Train's a very good product, but that thing is getting near the end of its life. Did it perform correctly? Yes, it did. Okay. It had no problems performing. There's a little problem with the conduit right there. Uh -huh. See how the conduit separated there? Yeah. And you can see the wire. So yeah. that needs to be repaired. That's okay. no big deal. Okay. Okay. Um, the only thing I can say with that is to get it tuned up and cleaned every year. Right. And keep your fingers crossed and try to hit, make it last for a few more years. Okay. But the good news is you got a good roof on there, so you don't have to worry about that. Right. 